little bit about how this came alive. Uh, well, we go back to 2013 when NK Theatre Arts did Quadrophenia. I thought, well, it's a concept album by The Who, and I've always been a big fan of Pink Floyd and the concept album The Wall. And I thought, well, if we can do Quadrophenia, we could probably do The Wall. And I've had the idea to do the show for a long, long time. And I collaborated with uh, Kerry, Dawn, Hannah. We sat down with some ideas. I went away and wrote a script. And I also felt I needed to get an endorsement from Pink Floyd. Yeah. So similar to Quadrophenia, when they got permission from Pete Townsend, I was able to get permission from Roger Waters. So is that cool having a letter from Roger it was, Waters? It was like a moment. It was a moment. Um, I was really chuffed. Um, and they gave us permission to do it. And we did three nights in 2014. And it, it was very well received. And we won two awards Yeah. Uh, for best vocal and best concept. And then we did it a year after. We got sponsorship from uh, Hughes Safety Showers. And we did it at the Palace Theatre for one night. So it's always been um, sort of an ambition to do a stage version of The Wall. And I'm amazed nobody else has done it because it lends itself so much to a, a music, a piece of musical theatre. And what, what will the audience, kind of, when they arrive, what, what kind of a production can they expect to see? Well, it's mixed on purpose. It's, it's a, a theatrical production because you've got dancing, movement, some acting, hardly any dialogue, but you've also got a live band who are on display all the way through the show. So it, it kind of caters to all types of audience where you'll watch a rock concert, you'll see the, the band in full view, and you'll get the theatre people who enjoy the musicals, you'll see all the action going on on the stage. So it, it, it mixes the two genres, rock concert and musical theatre, which is what I wanted to do. So that's quite unique, really, because there's is, not yeah. a lot of productions that will have that, is there? Well, you normally, get a, you normally get the orchestra in a pit or out of the way or hidden, whereas I think it's important because Pink Floyd, the band, um, you want it, people want to see them perform. So we've got a band here doing this production who are, who are just amazing. They do everything absolutely spot on and I want the audience to appreciate the band as much as the performers and that is different, that's not what you normally get in a musical.